Hi, my beautiful and amazing and wonderful and creative people around the world. How are you today? Oh, I just love each and every one of you. So, my morning was very eventful. <laughs> like, literally, it's like I was this close to becoming close to something, and I'm like, ah, oh, it was so scary. And I didn't know really why this was all happening, though. It's like a lot of interesting things have came and come. And they didn't really mean to happen, but they did. <laughs> So we're going to be talking about a little family trip and many things have really happened that's kind of intriguing. So there was his family, a group of five. They went on a trip and for some reason they really were trying to help their firstborn daughter out because for some reason her name her name was Kyla but Kyla's name was spelled bad like her first name really just said bad and bad Melissa yoke and she was like that's not my name my name is Kyla so they made a mistake during her like school and I was like and she was like what why is my name bad why is my first name bad even though my first name is Kyla that's so, it's like so weird because they were going on a trip a trip to a haunted house because there was like a theme party that was trying to be there and for some reason so they went to this haunted house after they fixed her name and like put it back to where it was supposed to be because it was like so confusing on why they said it's bad <laughs> so upon the house they went they had a little trip now this house had so many things in it so many very weird things and the eldest had just wins on her own because basically the gas station had a brochure saying hey we're just gonna get having little haunted house dean you are all invited so basically they all went and there was like a pack of people there were so many packs and for some reason, Mila just went on her own, on herself, by herself, really. And there was doors. And a few doors had to open because she thought she saw someone or something. A little boy. In that haunted house. And she was going to follow him. But for some reason, something was holding her back, saying, no, don't go. That's not a little boy. And doors were opening. And then there was this little girl holding a doll. The doll looked like Annabelle. But mostly with a calm and smoothing heart. And for some reason, her family, her mom and her sister came to get her. It's like, hey, where did you run off to? I was, I was looking for the restroom, but for some reason I heard a noise, and so I just went up all of a sudden. I don't know how I even got here. Well, don't go wandering off too far. So she stuck with her family, though, and they, they went into, like, a lot of creepy things. So basically, she saw this little girl just sitting there peacefully. And then when she, when she walked away, like, ah! And like, ah! And it's like, oh no. She's like, ah! And then for some reason, just walked. And then they walked by another girl who was just like walking, not sitting down on a chair. And now that she walked by, and it's like, it's like, 
the head turned like she was like because at that and the mother of that room came and they they went on a merry way but the little girl was still sitting there and so she's like just walking and walking we were walking and then we were near this fireplace it was so weird because the fireplace didn't really have anything and then for some reason there was this button and it said push me so basically either my brother or my mom or my little sister or should I say Carla's mother, mom, and little sister? Oh, I'm sorry. I feel like I'm quoting myself. <laughs> That's so weird. But anyways, her mom, her brother, or her sister had pushed a thing and it said, and then there was this little paper that's right there that says, step back near the door that you just entered. Step back. And so they step back. And then for some reason, the fireplace opened. And then this huge thing was popping out. It popped out. And it started singing. It started singing some... It was like really a good catchy song. But I didn't really know what the song was. Or she didn't really know what the song was. Oh great, now I really am quoting myself. That's so funny though. So she didn't really know what the song was. The song that played, and for some reason, everyone, there was a lot of people who came into the room, happy and dancing, and they had to stick close to each other, because they didn't know what would become of them, or what would happen, and then everything else ended, and so, they, they, everyone just came and went to look into all the other rooms, and for some reason, the mother, the father, her whole family said, it's time to go, oh, we had to get out now. And so they all turned, and basically, the sister was like, let's go, we're rushing. And they're like, oh, okay, we're rushing. So they all came down. And when they all came down, they turned their head, looked at the house, the house where they had entered. There were just no cars. There was no people. The door slammed shut behind them. And for some reason, there were eyes looking outside of the door. There were eyes. And the door opened again, but opened and closed, opened and closed. So they already ran back to their car. Cause like, ah, that's freaky. Okay, we're going. Bye. So they left. And then she got this weird call. Carla got this weird call saying, "We are glad you came." And we are grateful that you came, but you have to be careful for things may have already attached themselves to you. But know this, that you will be safe and you will not have anything that will come towards you and not have anything that will come harm you, for you are very much protected. And we thank you for leaving as quick as you can because there are things in this house that don't really like. Something that was admissed, something that was more, something that no one could have explained. And then it became weird. After that, it became weird. So that was, that's the end of my short story. I hope you guys have a lovely and amazing and wonderful day. Also, stay warm or stay cool for this weather is going all over the place and also like comment and subscribe down below and i love each and every one of you and i know that 
October is going to be quite an interesting month.